In previous video, we talked about the usage of uh, delays in milliseconds inside Vitas delay. And we, exa when we examined uh, the usage of portic period or portic rate and compared the results. In this video, we want to add the usage of PDMS to ticks, which essentially do the same it enables us to to um, make a delay inside VTASK in milliseconds. The usage is rather simpler that, uh, than the previous case. When we we in previous case we have to write the value in uh, milliseconds and divide it by 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 portic period uh, constant or portic rate constant for the older versions. Here we just write PDM MS to ticks and write the number in uh, milliseconds. Um, just to compare, we will run uh, this program which we where we will compare the ticks for 1 millisecond, 10 milliseconds, 100 and 1000 milliseconds and compare it to f for the pr f with the previous method. Let's uh, run the Like in the previous videos, we see the usage of uh, portic period dividing by the period between the interrupts uh, is less advisable for uh, s small delays like 1 or 10 milliseconds. Here we, it's we, we intended to use 10 milliseconds and actually it was 3 milliseconds. But when we are talking about 100 and 1000 milliseconds, the results are much better. As interestingly enough, the same uh, we see with the usage of PDMS to ticks, where for 1 and 10 milliseconds the results are not quite accurate. It's better for 1 millisecond, for 100 milliseconds, and uh, pretty good for 1000 milliseconds. Thank you.